Um, as we get toward the end of the game, I hear um, there, there's a, there's a gentleman from the organization. He comes over and he's talking to the coach. And I hear the coach say, oh, no, no, don't worry about it. We're going to get him after the game. So you knew they were talking it. about you. I, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. I, I just couldn't believe it. I'm like, no. So then at the end of the game, I, uh, I you hear the horn. This is where the video comes on. You hear the horn, and you see them making a beeline for me. Now, I'm just looking at the coach. That, that's my concentration. Um, and as the coach walks up on me, I say, coach, don't walk up on me. Don't walk up on me. But as the coach is walking up on me, I can see the players running around, and the players were the ones that start swinging. So I'm blocking them because I'm thinking, I don't want to hit these kids. Until it got to a point where I knew what was going to happen. And once I realized what was going to happen, I had to defend myself. I started swinging. At one point, it was, it was, it was survival. So I, I, I swung at one kid, hit another kid, and then it became a swarm. So then it, my survival instincts kick in as to don't pass out. Make sure you have your, your wherewithal. And... I kept thinking something's gonna happen. Either they're gonna stop or somebody's gonna help me out. Something, something's gotta happen. And when that happens, when they when they stopped, I jumped up, but then the blood was rushing from my ear. And my immediate thought was, if you go after somebody right now, you're gonna pass out with all this blood dripping from your ear. So I was like, you know what, I need to stop. And I just sat down on a chair. By that time, um, a couple of uh, people had come around and they were uh, handing me like papers and stuff to start, you know, uh, taking care of the damage. We. Uh, uh, the, the person from the organization said, you want me to call the police? And, yes, please call the police. So the police came and the uh, ambulance came. Ambulance completed the, uh, the, uh, the bandaging. Mm -hmm. and, um, and I told the police everything that happened. The, 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 the things that strike me that stood out the most here was it wasn't a crazy game. I didn't have to call technical fouls mm -hmm. in this game. Yeah. I gave one warning to both coaches. They were arguing with each other. Yeah. Calm down, guys. There was no rut. There, there, there was, it, wasn't, it wasn't a game where I foresaw this. Um, and I never met the coach before. I've never seen the players before. I've never ref their game. What made you that mad to then get together after the game to come at me like that? I, I, I still haven't figured that out. And that's the part that kind of hurts me the most. Is, mm -hmm. It's still a game. Yeah.